now we discuss the problem draw the graphs of 2x plus y is equal to 3 and 2x minus y plus 2 is equal to 0 shaded the region bounded by these lines and x axis also find the area of the shaded portion first we draw the two graphs 2x minus y plus 2 is equal to 0 and 2x plus y is equal to 6. These are two linear equations in two variables x and y. So the graph of a linear equation is a straight line. To draw a straight line we have we need only two points. Okay we need only two points. Joining that two points we get the line. First 2x plus y is equal to 0. 2x plus y is equal to 6, not 0. 2x plus y is equal to 6. If we choose x is equal to 2, we get 2 into 2 plus y equals 6. That is y is equal to 6 minus 2. Therefore, y is equal to 2. So, x is equal to 2, then y is equal to 2. You may choose x as 1, x as 0, x as minus 1. If you choose any a number as x. So if x is equal to 2, then y is equal to 2. Also, when x is equal to 3, what is y? 2 into 3 plus y is equal to 6. Therefore, y is equal to 6 minus 6, that is 0. So we get the two points. 2, 2 and 3, 0. We get the two points 2, 2 and 3, 0. Then we mark the points 2, 2. x is equal to 2. That is this distance is 2. x is 2 means this distance is 2. And y is 2 means this height is 2. Okay. So x, x 2, y 2. 2, 2. The point 2, 2 is here. It is from the origin, the distance is 2 and the height is also 2. That is the point 2, 2. Then we mark 3, 0. The distance is 3 and the height is 0. So this here it is, this point is 3, 0. Okay. Here it is 2, 2 and the 3, 0. Now we join these line, these points, we get the line 2x plus y is equal to 0. Uh, sorry, 6. 2x plus y is equal to 6. Here it is like this. When x is equal to 0, when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 6. When x is equal to 0, y is equal to 6 means this line touches the y axis at a 6. At the point 6, it touches the y-axis. Okay. When x is equal to 0, we get y is equal to 6. That means it touches the y-axis at the point 6. Okay. That is the graph of 2x plus y is equal to 6. Then what about 2x minus y plus 2 is equal to 0? When x is equal to 0, when x is equal to 0, into 0 minus y plus 2 equal to 0. That is 0 minus y plus 2 is equal to 0 or y is equal to 2 or y is equal to 2. That is when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 2. What is x is equal to 1? When x is equal to 1, we get y is equal to 4. So we get the two points as 0, 2 and 1, 4. So we mark the points. 0, 2. The point 0, 2. And 1, 4. 1, 4. This is the point 1, 4. The distance is 1. The height is 4. So 1, 4. This is the point 1, 4. Joining these two points.
sorry, the point is 1, 4 is 1 here. The distance is 1 and 4. So this is the point 1, 4. Okay. This is the point 1, 4. So we join these two these two points. 1, 4 is also a point on this line also because 2 into 1 plus 4 is 6 also. Uh, 1, 4 is a point in this line also. And it meet the, and the 2x minus y plus 2 meet the x axis. That is when y is equal to 0, uh, x is equal to minus 1. So it meets the x axis at the point minus 1. Okay. When y is equal to 0, x is equal to minus 1. So it means minus 1 also. The line. This is the graph of the two lines and shaded the region bounded by these two lines and x-axis. These two lines and x-axis. So shade the portion above the x-axis and the between these two lines. This is the shaded portion of the given region. Okay. Also find the area of the shaded region. Also find the area of the shaded region. Here we get a triangle. What is the area of a triangle? Area of here name it as ABC. Area of triangle ABC is equal to half into base into height half into base into height that is equal to half into what is base length from 0 to 3 the distance is 3 also from 0 to minus 1 the distance is 1 so total base length is 4 so put here 4 what is the height here the midpoint is 0 1 2 3 so, total 4. So, 1 is the midpoint. Here we draw a line. What is the length? That is 1, 4 is the point here. So, 4 is the height. So, 4 into 4 by 2. That is 16 by 2. That is equal to 8. 8, sim, 8 square units are na. So, 8 square units is the area of the triangle ABC.